Hey, everybody. You know, we love it when someone from Buffalo makes it big, and our next guest is surely on her way. Nationally recognized gospel artist Sharifa is back in her hometown to perform at the Taking It to the Streets rally in MLK Park this weekend. But she's here as our guest this morning to talk about her blooming career, and we want to welcome you home, Sharifa. Thank you for your invite. Oh my goodness, this is great. Congratulations on this. Thank you. Thank you. And what's it like being represented by you know a national record company and having your music out there? It's awesome. It's definitely a, a, a dream come true. Um, things that little girls dream of. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You have this incredible voice. What led you to gospel music? Uh, gospel is my, my backbone uh, or the root. <laughs> uh, my mother and my grandmother are both preachers. Um, my oh. grandmother was a pastor for many years and she put uh, uh, a lot of our talents on display. So. I see. So are you the only singer in your family or are there more? No, there are, there are more. <laughs> <laughs> my mother was a singer. Uh, I have uh, a br uh, two brothers who actually have uh, albums out as well. Um, my sister sings very oh. well, um, so it's 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 in the family. My father was a doo-wop singer. Oh my goodness! So, yeah. Wow. How did you get discovered? Uh, I I really don't know how to answer that. You know, uh, basically, uh, we sang in church all the time. Um, uh, in the community, any outreach or community event, uh, make sure that uh, we go out and just being helpful mm -hmm. to people, you know. Uh, there's, a, like I said uh, prior, uh, this is the first album, mm -hmm. but we've put uh, songs out on the internet before ah. that has not actually made it to the album. And believe it or not, one of the songs on the CD, uh, Show Me Your Grace, actually was in Belgium before anyone heard it in the United States. Amazing. So, yeah. Amazing. So you're garnering international attention. Yes. That's fantastic. <laughs> that is wonderful. So you have folks still here in Buffalo. Yes. You want to do a shout out and let them know that you're back and you're, you're excited. Yes. You to know, be, uh, uh, hello to my mother and my friends, Ernest. That's <laughs> um, <laughs> my keyboardist, you know, uh, to my vocal director, uh, Tia Douglas, and to all that has been instrumental in making me who I am today. That's fantastic. <laughs> Sharifa, do you find yourself, uh, do, you, do you love just this medium of gospel music, or do you find yourself some, somewhere down the line crossing over to pop? Or I love all music. Mm -hmm. I love jazz. I, uh, believe it or not, I love country. Yeah. I love Reba McIntyre and Garth Brooks, and I would love to do a little bit of everything, but I do not want to stray away from gospel. Mm -hmm. um, it's the reason why I am alive today is the reason why I breathe. Yeah. So yeah, I, I would love to, you know, just maybe be supportive in the other fields, but actually uh, release another type of album or mm -hmm. another genre, I don't think I would. You know, it's interesting, Sharifa, because so many other big stars were first singing in church. Yeah. Whitney Houston, mm -hmm. uh, Aretha Franklin. Yes. I mean, it, it goes on and on. Were you inspired by some of those legends? Oh, yes. Most definitely Aretha Franklin and uh, Gladys Knight, mm -hmm. who also started in the church. Um, uh, Bryant McKnight, who also yes. started in the church. Uh, Whitney Houston was every young girl's dream, most definitely. Uh, the voice, mm. the uh, just the ideal of being Whitney Houston, you know. Uh, so, yeah, yeah, I just, I don't know, uh, I, just the inspiration of great artists, you know, to know that they started in the church is a wonderful thing, yeah. but just who they became mm -hmm. is even more phenomenal, mm. you know, uh, because the gospel industry is just a small yeah. portion. Uh, but to be able to use your voice, God-given voice, to speak to the world, mm -hmm. you know, and to me, a lot of Whitney Houston songs were still God-given, yeah. you know. Uh, I agree. Uh, I can't think of the song about the children right mm -hmm. now, but mm -hmm. yeah, they were definitely God-breathed and God-given. Now, so. do you write some of your material yes, as well? Yes, I do. You do? I do. Oh, that's interesting, too. Yes. Yeah, because <laughs> you know what? Before you know it, somebody's going to be covering your songs, and how cool would that be? That would be awesome. Yeah, that would be just super. <laughs> so tell us about what you're going to be performing, because Sharifa is going to be performing at the Taking It to the Streets rally at MLK Junior Park, and you're going to be there both Saturday and Sunday, right? Uh, I believe I will only be there Sunday. Okay, just uh, Sunday. Okay. I will be supportive. I'll be there Saturday, but I won't be performing okay. Saturday. Okay. All right. Uh, and I will be performing. Um, 
Jesus is mi corazón, mm. and also show me your grace. Oh. And I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to just being out there with the people and rubbing shoulders and just talking to people. Not necessarily performing. I love that, but just the interaction with the community and 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 fans. You know, I I do still have a a lot of fans here in oh, Buffalo. Oh yeah. And, and just to to be there with the people will be an awesome experience. Well, you'll be meeting thousands yes. because this is a huge. This is the 24th annual. Mm -hmm. And you know it gets bigger and better every year. But how long has this been out, and can people get this everywhere? Yes, especially here in Western New York, it is in every bookstore, oh, that's um, good. and you can get it online at www.sharifa.net. Uh, but it's been out since June 1st. Oh, great! So, yeah. Oh, great! And what has been the response? It's been great. Yeah, everyone's favorite is crossing over. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So, yeah, it's getting a lot of buzz. Are you getting ready for a second one already? Oh, yes, most definitely. We're in the studio already. Beautiful. So. Now, when you're here to sing, how many people are with you? Or is it just your keyboardist? Oh, no, I have uh, sometimes two keyboardists. Oh, I my have, goodness. I Thank. have background singers, um, a bass guitarist, uh, sometimes a lead guitarist, a drummer, a crazy drummer. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and just a, a large entourage. I have a great assistant and, uh, you know, just different people, you know, people behind the scenes that make it all work. Well, you know what? They, they have really pulled out the stops for the entertainment at Taking It to the Streets yes, this year. So I'm so glad that they brought you home and people will get to see really the entire stage show. I mean, Sharifa, with everybody around you to, to bring to life some of these songs. Yes. I mean, that's just fantastic. Yes. Looking for it. Oh, I guess you are. Yeah, that is great. But we are just thrilled about your success. Thank you. Where do you go after Western New York? I mean, are you touring? Are you? Not yet. Mm -hmm. uh, we will be in Chicago uh, by the end of this month, uh, just doing a spot on radio. But I'm looking to go anywhere, uh -huh. you know, wherever. Uh, I don't plan on turning down anything. Uh -huh. <laughs> but um, my the world is my... Uh, uh, audience. I want to go everywhere. I want to go to Australia. I want to go to Belgium. I want to go to China. Well, you so. know what, Sharifa? You are on your way. <laughs> Thank you. Because it's a, it's a delightful, wonderful album. It's called Uncovered. It's out there on CD. And let me tell you, everybody, Sharifa has got one magnificent gift in her voice, and you are going to love it. So be watching for her Sunday out at MLK Park. Sharifa, thank you so much. <laughs>